animals have a point of clinical death do plants and if they do how is it determined if you want to know this answer without skipping watch this video if you like the my answer please like it and comment it answer here the concept of clinical death in animals is not as straightforward as you might think for people it's really just a hard and fast legal and medical justification for stopping treatment because in practice there is a continuum of deterioration marked by a number of events what's more indicators of clinical death in some animals do not necessarily mean the same in others for instance cessation of respiration or heartbeat or brain activity is a bad sign in mammals but in some creatures it is a regular event during hibernation in plants the events are less well marked than in animals but the amount to the same thing while wilting poisoning disease or starvation exceeds a given intensity we can say the plant is dead but you could argue that most of its cells are still alive and that you could culture them and get a new plant or maybe even clone the same plant this might be true but some applies to any person at the point of clinical death most of the person's cells are alive and many of them would be good for cloning for a while anyway if you like my answer please comment it thank you